So I'm joined by Michael Meany, member of the All Auckland Senior Football Team. Uh, Michael, I suppose 2015 is done and dusted now at this stage. Um, I know your runners up in the county final, the Palatine, and you won't be lacking the motivation this year, I suppose, to try to win that Conlon Cup back. No, definitely not. Uh, very disappointed last year. Uh, Pal were by far the better team, I suppose, on the day. But look, at every year is a new year, and I don't think we lack motivation, like you said. And just looking forward to getting back into the championship now in what four or five weeks, and it's the big thing for us, really. I suppose without putting the blink on it and, and just bringing up bad memories, it's two county finals you have lost in a row. Um, it's obviously playing on your minds a bit. Do you think it's a bit of baggage to be carrying going into it, or how can you kind of deal with it and maybe turn it into success? I don't think we see it as baggage, to be fair. Um, that might be the view from the outside, but yeah, we've lost two. Um, but I think every year is a kind of a fresh start, a new beginning. Um, I wouldn't dwell on it too much. I don't think most lads dwell on it too much. Yes, you obviously use it as motivation, but I don't think it's a it's a deciding factor in you know why you go back every year, why you train hard every year. But it obviously is a motivating factor, but it's not it's not, a, not a big issue for us, I don't think. And of course, you've changed things up a bit now. Dizzy Shaw's on board as, as manager and stuff, and. Uh, I suppose you know Carol Dwyer done a terrific job, won a, car, won a county championship with you. Um, but I suppose, did you feel a fresh face was kind of needed? And how, how good is, is Des in comparison to Carl? Carl was excellent. Carl, uh, as you said, won a championship, he won a league with us. Uh, he was there for three years, got to three county finals. Um, Des is different. Carl was extremely steady, uh, very good man manager, uh, uh, had a good kind of a knowledge of the players, a good knowledge of football. I suppose Desi is different in the sense that um, uh, training is a bit different, uh, maybe more scientific, but it's a lot more enjoyable. Uh, really enjoying training with Desi this year, and I suppose, like you say, it is something a bit fresh, it is something a bit different, and uh, maybe that's what we needed. But uh, no, so far it's been very good. Obviously, the league final was a bit of a blip, and it's something we have to look at. But look at you know, I think so far so good with Desi. He's been he's been excellent, and he's got a great response from the players. And I suppose, yeah, you mentioned that league final. It was. Uh, an old, an old friend of yours, Joe Murphy, was involved with Airog, and I suppose he fairly knew he inside out, or at least it looked like that on the day. But chance for a retribution now in Championship as well, because I know Airog on that side. Absolutely, yeah. As I said, Airog were unbelievable on the day. We just couldn't deal with them. You know, it's going to be a massive challenge for us coming up against them in the, it's the second round now. Um, you know, we're going to have a huge task to try to overturn what happened in the league final. You genuinely worry about the pace that they bring, you know, are we up to it? But look, I don't think we're going to lack for, for motivation. Yeah, sure, Joe knows his inside out, but I think we have a fair idea of what we, what we bring to the table as well, so looking forward to that. I suppose there's enough of lads saying around the county that you're an agent team, this, that and the other, but I suppose people that are saying that aren't aware of the likes of Niall Roach, Aaron Am, and these younger lads coming through, so there's plenty of talent, I suppose, to bolster the squad as well. Absolutely. Uh, like the last two or three years, like we've got a lot of young lads, Shawnee Bambrick as well, and uh, Ian Atkinson, Aaron, um, you know, Pori, Cockton. Uh, serious talent, unbelievable young lads coming through, and like you say, a lot, a lot of people don't know about the work that they're putting in, and they're a great asset to the team, and I think we have a good mix at the moment of kind of youth and experience, but they're, they're great young lads, and they're, they're really pushing the, the senior players and the more experienced players a bit. So how confident are you that you can go all the way this year and make up for those last two defeats? Uh, at the moment, uh, you know, it's, it's very early stages. Like, uh, Not to give you the, the clichéd answer, we have a lot of work to do. Uh, I think we're getting there, but I'd be confident that you know, we're not going to lack for any motivation. And I think when it comes, hopefully, to the, to the business end of the championship quarter-finals, we'll be there. And if, you know, if we can get to the quarter-finals, get out of the group, anything can happen from there. But I think we need to try to uh, build a bit of momentum and try to get a win or two under our belt first and then see where we're at.